Harry Crazy over Williams' new uniform marks a unique honour as aide-de-camp appointed by multiple monarchs. While Harry has always prided himself in his medal-laden uniform, he's certainly envious of his brother's new uniform. William debuts the new uniform with major change during an investiture at Windsor Castle on Wednesday. The Prince of Wales made a poignant gesture of respect to both his father, King Charles III, and late grandmother, Queen Elizabeth II, through a tweak to his uniform. The change was spotted on Wednesday when the Prince of Wales held an investiture ceremony at Windsor Castle, as Prince William distributed honours to Lionesses, soccer stars Beth Mead and Lucy Bronze, former Palace advisor Jason North and more. Two royal ciphers were unusually spotted on the right shoulder strap of his military uniform, above his golden braided aguilettes with the royal monograms for his grandmother, who died in September, and his father, who was crowned in a glittering ceremony on Saturday. According to a tweet by Isagur, this unique honour makes William the first since Lord Mountbatten to be appointed as aide-de-camp by multiple monarchs. The tweet quickly garnered attention, highlighting the historical significance of the event. Sources reported that the ciphers signify Prince William's roles as an aide-de-camp to Queen Elizabeth and King Charles. The honorary positions are unpaid and awarded at the discretion of the monarch, the Ministry of Defence said. While Queen Elizabeth made Prince William an aide-de-camp a decade ago, his honour from King Charles is new, though it remains unclear when the King bestowed the role. The Prince of Wales only wore Queen Elizabeth's initials at his most recent investiture before Wednesday in October 2022. The Prince of Wales wore the ceremonial dress uniform of the Welsh Guards with the mantle of the Order of the Garter and formal robes to the coronation Saturday, so the King's cipher wasn't visible then. Prince William memorably paid homage to his father during the church service, kneeling before the monarch after he was crowned to pledge allegiance. Meanwhile, the Duke of Sussex only bowed his head for about five seconds as King Charles passed. Other members of the royal family sitting around Prince Harry, including Sophie, the Duchess of Edinburgh and Princess Anne, were also seen bowing or curtsying as King Charles processed. Kate Middleton was also spotted curtsying to her father-in-law on the big day. Prince William is now one step closer to the British throne, a role he's been preparing for his entire life. As heir, William was put through years of training to ensure the survival of the British monarchy. Charles, now 74, becomes the oldest monarch to ever assume the British throne. Royal experts such as Marlene Koenig believe Charles knows his time is shorter in the role and sees himself as a caretaker of the throne for William. As such, the task of ensuring the monarchy not only survives but thrives in the 21st century rests heavily on William's shoulders. But experts say that to pull it off, he'll need to keep up with the changing times.